Hey pilots, Delaney here with Maverick, and today I'm going to show you how to become a certified drone pilot. To start, we're going to go on the FAA website, and I'll have that linked for you below. Now that we're on this page, we're going to read through all of the information and requirements to become a pilot, and when you're finished, we're going to click the link on step one. So now that we're on this page, I'm a new user, so I'm going to go start registration. Because I'm just a standard applicant, the only box I'm going to check is the applicant box, and then I'm going to agree to the terms of service. All right, so I'm going to fill out this information real quick and I'll be right back. So now that we filled out all of that information, it gave us an FTN number and our username, which we will need to become a drone pilot. Now let's proceed to step two. So now that we have all that information, we're going to go and schedule our test. Okay, so now on this page, we're going to go ahead and view the test authorization requirements. So this is just some general information that you'll need if you're worried about the requirements you need to take the test. Now let's jump back and create our account. So now I'll go back to this previous page and then copy my FTN number. And then, and then I'm going to paste it right here. Um, no. And now we're just going to agree to the usage acknowledgement. Now we're just going to continue creating our account. Now that we have all of our information punched in, we're going to go ahead and continue the process. Now we're just going to click continue. Now we're going to register. Okay, so now we're going to go through and select the type of test we want to take, and I want to take the part 107. Now that we found it, we're going to press select. So now they're looking for pre-exam data, and here I'm only going to press one because I've never taken the test before. And then for authorization category, we're going to click on none. So if you need any assistance during your test, this is where you would be putting that down. I do not, so I will be clicking no accommodation needed. So now we're on the page where we're going to look for a location near me to take the test. So now I'm going to click on I understand and agree for the scheduling procedures. So all of my information is now filled out up here, and now you can see that my nearest testing center available is in Woodbury, and here are the available times. Now we're going to go ahead and select a time, and then schedule. All right, so that's how you become a drone pilot and how you can schedule your FAA test. If you have any questions pertaining to the Part 107, please reach out to us here at Maverick, and we'll be able to help you. Have a great day, and thank you for watching.